Hello everybody, in today's video we are going to take a look at how to craft one of these fantastically fantastic <laughs> wolf fur capes. These are great because they are resistant versus frost. That means that when you wander around cold biomes, you will not freeze to death. Uh, so what you will need to craft one of these wolf fur capes, uh, you will basically need to have uh, you will need to have uh, crafted an iron pickaxe, number one, because in order to mine silver, which we need, uh, you do need an iron pickaxe. Uh, we also need some wolf pelts, of course, and one wolf head trophy. Um, so if you don't have iron yet, you will be able to get that from one of the swamp biomes. I have a video coming up about how to find swamp biome and how to get iron, so you can check that out if you're not too sure how to do that. Otherwise, uh, what you'll need to also actually do is uh, craft yourself up some, let's see, craft yourself up a few frost resistance potions. In order to do that, you need some honey, you need some thistles, some blood bags, and of course, gray dwarf eyes. Uh, honey, you can get, of course, from your beehives. I'm sure you figured that out by now. Thistle you can pick up in the swamp or in the black forest biomes. They are just growing randomly. They glow. They're easy to spot. Grab some thistle. Blood bags are obtained from uh, leeches in the swamp. And great odor eyes, I'm sure you know where to get those. Uh, once you have crafted the mead up, you just drop that into your fermenter. Wait for a while, a couple of, of in-game days I believe it takes, and then once those are ready, you have got your frost resistance potions they look something like this they last for about 10 minutes per swig so uh, i believe you get six of them from one from oh, is it three to six? you get three or six of them i think you get six of them from one crafting session one frost resistance mead so six should be enough that'll give you an hour to explore around the uh, four frosty biomes which is where we are going to head right now and uh, what you're going to need to do is just basically start searching around for wolves. Uh, you may need to, to kill quite a few wolves in order to find the wolf head. The pelts are you know, easy to find. The wolf heads can take a little bit longer. But, yep, there's nothing else you can do. Uh, I believe you need one head, one head, one wolf head, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's just one wolf head. So we're going to search around in this frosty, frosty biome. Don't forget to drink your poison resistance potion. Oh, sorry, your frost resistance potion. And, oh man, just about fell to my death <laughs> or something. Uh, oh, uh, you may have probably realized this, but if you're traveling around the mountainy area and you find yourself with a cliff you can't get up, hold down sprint. That'll get you up most locations, and the locations it doesn't, jump, jump, jump. Jump, 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 and you should be able to get yourself up pretty much any anywhere. Of course, as long as you have stanima, that is a condition. Um, but otherwise, yeah, that's how to get around. There's a wolf over there. Great if you can see them before they see you. Uh, because then, of course, you can get that sneak shot in. And if you can get the sneak shot in, you can sometimes one-shot them if you've got... Uh, a decent bow. So I got the wolf pelt from here. I think I'm going to need six of those in total and one wolf head. So I'm going to gather those up. You'll need to gather those up for yourself. And when we've all gathered up our everything what we'll need, we'll meet back here and we'll craft our, our, our wolf pelt. Actually, you know what? Here's the other bit. Here's the other bit that's rather important. Uh, and that is that is the well you, you've got to find your silver so let's uh look around for our silver in order to find silver what you'll need to do is you'll have need to have your wishbone equipped if you don't have a wishbone you can obtain a wishbone by slaying bone mass i was a tiny bit curious what those sparkly sparkly things were in a distance but when you have your wishbone equipped there we go it'll start beeping when you've discovered a silver deposit And you just kind of wander around until that beeping gets to be its fastest. There, there we go. 
Seems about right. And then once you found your spot, start digging. Whoa. Okay. All right. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> I guess that's what those glittery spots were. Oh, ouch, ouch. Uh, yeah, stone golems are pretty tough. They are... Oh, man. They're, they're, they're just pretty tough. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to have to deal with this guy here. Hopefully I brought enough arrows. Yikes. <laughs> they have a, a ranged hit. So basically, sort of a splash damage area of effect when, when they attack. So you need to get a bit of distance. Okay, all right. It's one stone golem down. Gather up some of these pretty crystals. And we'll get back to our mining. Where was our hole? Here it is. Here's our hole. So somewhere in here should be the silver vein. I like to kind of go a little bit wide because you're not too sure where the silver might be. There we go. All right, there's our silver vein. Perfect. So what I usually like to do when I find something, just mark it down so you've got your little uh, notation. We are going to need uh, a couple bits of silver. I don't know how much. So I'll just grab a bit of silver here, and then we will head back to back to the hunt. All right, so I'll see you guys when you have all of your wolf pelts and your wolf head, and we'll meet back and we'll craft up our, uh, craft up our wolf cloak. All right, I just found my wolf trophy. Perfect. Let's uh, let's head back to uh, my little crafting station here. So for the purposes of crafting your wolf pelt, depending on how much sailing you want to do, how much silver you want to gather, uh, what I've actually put together is a little portable blacksmithery because you can transport most of the... Actually, you can transport all the stuff you need through a gate, so you can just craft your... Uh, your wolf pelt in the mountains on the spot. So all we need is, uh, oh, I think I need a little bit more wolf peltage, which I think I have somewhere, somewhere nearby. There we go, there's one. <laughs> okay, so I have smelted a bit of silver and I have my wolf head, my wolf pelt. Time to craft my wolf Cape, what am I missing? I'm missing one thing. <laughs> um, four silver, my bad. Four silver, not two silver. Four silver bits, all right. There we go, there's our, full, our wolf fur cape, which keeps you nice and warm in the frost. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Hope you guys have enjoyed today's video. Uh, and uh, yeah, subscribe. I'll be doing more tips, Valheim tips videos uh, as, as in the future. <laughs>